Hello my lovelies and welcome back to my channel. Wait, babe, why does my hair look so dark in the camera? Is it the lighting? I'm just kidding you guys. I actually got my hair colored. <laughs> We're going a lot lighter tomorrow, but I still wanted to film the first day. So let's get started. So obviously I did get a cut and color in my hair. It's totally different. And this is only the base. So tomorrow I'm going back again for another session and we're doing a much lighter silver gray balayage style. Even though I'm not done with my hair color yet, I did want to do a hairstyle just for my own curiosity and just share it with you guys as well, just to see how well it braids with this type of hair color. But this is where I want your guys' opinion to see if you guys like it more like monotone, you know, more of like one of the same color hair or you do like that more dimension in the braid. So basically you can see that I sectioned my hair off like slightly behind the ear, basically taking like the fringe or the bangs of the front hair and I just have it hanging loose because that's where we're going to do the headband. So take the rest of the hair and we're going to pin it back. Once you have the section parted off, we're going to take this front hair and I'm going to place it down and I'm going to make sure the hair is going the way we're going to braid it, kind of like the headband going the opposite way. So grab the hair and kind of section it off right above the ear. We're gonna make a section to start braiding. So divide the section into three pieces. We're gonna be doing a Dutch braid. So taking it the pieces and tucking them underneath the middle without adding hair first. Once you have the initial braid done, this is where the lace braid begins. You're gonna place the section that's closest to your head down Grab a section all the way over to the part where we parted it off. Grab it to that section, and then we're gonna place it right underneath the middle portion. Taking this section in here that's farthest away, without any hair, we're gonna tuck it underneath. Let me show you one more time. Take the section right here, and grab hair all the way to the middle portion, where we portioned it off, and we're gonna tuck that underneath. So you're only adding hair to the first section. Grab hair, tuck it underneath, underneath. And this is what creates that lace braid effect. So once you get to the other side of the ear, to the top of it, you're just gonna finish braiding the braid off like a Dutch braid without adding any extra hair to the braid. And kind of pull it back when you braid it so that when you place it down, it's gonna be nice and close to your scalp. All right, so now I'm gonna go back in and kind of loosen up the braid just a little bit. Take the braid and then take some hair behind the ear and then we're gonna tie that portion together, the braid with a little bit of hair behind the ear, just to make sure the braid is laying flat down on your head behind the ear. So once you let the rest of the hair go, this is, you'll see that you have like a nice headband with a braid. So basically you can leave your hair like this or you can add a little bit of curl in your hair, a wave with a straightener like I showed you guys. I'll have it linked down below where you can curl your hair with a straightener or what I like to do if I'm gonna have an active day and like go to the gym or play some sports, I just divide my hair into twos and I'm gonna create two low pigtails because why not, it's super cute. And it makes me feel like a little girl again. Sometimes you know, you just wanna be a kid. Just do it into two pigtails and it looks super cute. And there you have it. It's super cute, it's fun, and it's perfect for an active lifestyle. All right, you guys, let me know your thoughts on this hair color and this hairstyle. Do you guys like the hair color where it's a little bit more monotone or do you guys like it more dimensional? And for this hairstyle, I love wearing it on those more active days where I know I'm gonna go to the gym, work out, or play some kind of sport, or just basically do a bunch of errands. My hair is out of the face and it'll look super cute at the same time. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and letting me explore my hair a little bit more before I get it finished. But next week I will have the video done for you guys showing you the vlog style process of how we finish and color and cut my hair. So watch out for the video next week on Wednesday and I'll see you guys then. I love you all very much. Bye.